a mother has demanded her six-year-old son's school ban Sleeping Beauty because the princess does not give consent to be kissed. Sarah Hall, from Northumberland Park, North Shields, claimed the fairy tale promotes an inappropriate sexual message to young children. She argued the story is irresponsible because it teaches children it is acceptable to kiss women while they are asleep. The mother of two said, I think it's a specific issue in the Sleeping Beauty story about sexual behavior and consent. It's about saying is this still relevant, is it appropriate? Ms. Hall is worried about what message the tale, which features a prince waking up a princess by kissing her sends to impressionable youngsters. The 40-year-old left a comment in her son's record book, and contacted the school to ask if it could be taken out of circulation for younger classes. She said, in today's society, it isn't appropriate, my son is only six, he absorbs everything he sees, and it isn't as if I can turn it into a constructive conversation. I don't think taking Sleeping Beauty books out of circulation completely would be right. I actually think it would be a great resource for older children, you could have a conversation around it, you could talk about consent, and how the princess might feel. But I'm really concerned about it for younger children, would really welcome a conversation about whether this is suitable material. Ms. Hall said recent coverage of sexual abuse including the social media Me Too campaign, made her think about the messages being sent to youngsters. She said, these are indicative of how ingrained that kind of behavior is in society. All these small things build up, and they make a difference. Ms. Hall said there might be problems with other fairy tales, but that she is mostly disturbed by the non-consensual kissing in this story. She said, I think it's a specific issue in the Sleeping Beauty story about sexual behavior and consent. It's about saying is this still relevant, is it appropriate? Ms. Hall has attracted widespread criticism after she tweeted about the issue earlier this week. Posting a picture from her son's Sleeping Beauty book, she wrote, Tell you what, while we are still seeing narratives like this in school, we are never going to change ingrained attitudes to sexual behavior. However, many have disagreed and have labeled her as pathetic and sad. One tweeter wrote, Do not confuse this rant with feminism, this is harmful to the cause in a catastrophic way, not helpful. While another fumed, hard to believe and very unfortunate that there are people acting as sad as at Hallmeister and her sleeping beauty should be banned nonsense. Feel sorry for the kids having to dwell on this see asterisk asterisk asterisk. One woman said, this is getting b asterisk 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 ridiculous. I never once watched sleeping beauty and thought goodness this is giving the wrong message about consent. Let's ban Cinderella as well whilst we're on the matter, poor gender roles and all that. Another wrote, are you actually being serious ha 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 how pathetic hash world has gone mad. One tweeter posted, did the book or film make you believe you go around kissing anyone when you were a kid? Do you do that now because of the film? No. Then what is the problem?